good people of YouTube, my name is Spanner. Welcome to another episode of Dark Souls 3. Now, you may notice I'm in a different place. I have uh, two less levels than last time. And I have uh, the items are a bit different. A bit, well, mostly because I organized them. But uh, I have some things I didn't have. Like, uh, 23 Sunlight Medals. Why is that? You ask. Well, that's a very good question. So, after I recorded the, um, episode 15, which was the last one, I had enough backlog so I could, uh, do some other things, including, uh, formatting my computer, which was, uh, way overdue. And I did! I got a new, a brand new SSD with more room, with more storage space, and it's awesome! And I formatted the old one. And uh, apparently Dark Souls 3 doesn't save to the Steam Clouds. So, yeah. That was fun. That was fun realizing that. X um, Dark Souls 1 does, I'm pretty sure about that, so I didn't even consider doing a backup of the save file. Yeah. And that was rough. Anyways, I'm basically... what's that icon? Oh, is that the... Oh, it was the milk ring. Yeah. Yeah, so I ba I basically did everything the same way. I just helped more people with sunlight medals. We got our Wolnir's Holy Sword here. Our armor that we had. Our rings. Our Grass Crest Shield. And I made it to exactly the same place we were at. So we can safely continue. Hooray! Just have two less levels. No big deal. Even though I help more, I help more people. I have less levels. Haven't even died that often. I guess it's basically because I I help less people in the Abyss Watchers. I help a lot. And I mean a lot in the Crystal Sage. So that's probably less souls overall. But yeah, we had just killed. Night Slayer Tsorig. So that's where we were, and we were by the Lava Lake. I'm also considering getting a new weapon eventually. I know every time I Google things about faith builds. Everyone mentions the Lothric Knight Greatswords. And I'm interested in, in trying it out. Uh, we don't, however, have the stats for it. So, once we do... We'll see... Well, we, we don't even have one. So once we do have one, we'll see if we can make it work. Okay, please don't kill me, Mr. Black Knight. Thank you. Ooh, got some Black Knight leggings. Alright, we're basically done with this area already. Just have two things we have to do. Well, we don't have to do one of them. 
which is the one I'm going to do right now. We're going to shut down that uh, pesky ballista that keeps shooting at us. Because once we enter Smoldering Lake, it's a short walk. Oh, I... Wait, what did I just do? Wasn't... That's what I get for not paying attention. Wasn't there supposed to be a platform over there? Well, it's... at least I can just... rush it. The only enemy we have to worry about is the Black Knight. So, let's go for it. So, yeah, basically I have the uh, same build we had. I guess we have uh, two less points in faith because we're... Uh, two levels lower. <clears throat> I don't know if I'll continue leveling Faith for now. I would like to get some more st enough strength and dexterity to get um, to use that uh, Lothric Knight Great Swords. I'm sorry, what? You're persistent, aren't you? Yeah, I like to use that weapon. Everyone says that a, bl a blessed Lothric Knight Greatsword is amazing for a faith build. Because the weapon itself deals uh, lightning damage already. And and blessed, the blessed infusion makes it so... Ow! I walked right into that, didn't I? As I was saying, and the Blessed Infusion adds um, Faith Scaling as physical damage. As opposed to a Lightning Infusion, which adds Faith Scaling on uh, Lightning Damage. It adds, light it adds Lightning Damage based on uh, Faith Scaling. And since the weapon already has Lightning Damage, I guess that makes a blessed infusion better. I don't know. I have never used it. I don't even know if I if I will like the move set. This one, it's all right. I I, I would prefer more um more sweeping strikes. This, these ones are a bit too vertical. Th this is good though. Basically, I would like something like this. Well, this is good on this is good on on the the one hand, so it's it it it's quite all right. Oh God damn it! I misjudged the combo again. Ugh. Not off to a good start, are we? Yeah, so... I don't know. I don't know if I'll... Um, keep going Faith, because I, w I would love to have a proper... Faith Offensive Miracle. Like the Lightning Stake. Is it... Is it uh, how it's called? Lightning Stake? Yeah, Lightning Stake. I'd like to try that out, but that's at 35 Faith, so it'll be a while. Uh, 
Oh, and I've also realized I probably made a bit of a mistake. So, I did not trigger the Yuria quest line, since we did not draw draw out our true power five times from Yoel. Uh, Yuria did not appear. And, um... She kinda sells a Divine Tome. Even though it's for Dark Miracles, but she sells one. So we will not have access to that. And it's a bit unfortunate. I completely forgot she sold one. Oh boy. Easy now. There. Got him. Oh, we even got a helm. Okay, ladder. What did I do wrong last time? I, There was probably another ladder that we needed to take, and I forgot about that. I'm 99% sure that was the case. Yeah, see? I forgot there was another step here. And I wanted to drop down there. Okay, Dragon Rider Bow. Okay, now we're all the way up here. And we will immediately... Yeah, we, we hear the gears already. It's already aiming... Oh, it even hit me. Okay, but now we should be safe here. Oh, and I'm using the canvas talent. The canvas talisman. Right now. It's good enough. some bone wheels might as well get this one both dead permanently now I have those two to deal with I hate dealing with these guys Wow got completely obliterated, didn't I? Let's go. One more time. I wish this was a shorter path. And then we still need to kill the boss. The boss... the boss might be... a bit tough, I think. For our build to deal with as of this moment. But I think we can handle it. Let's 
fight over here. Ow. No. Don't. Don't kill me. I just, just want to backstab you. I shouldn't have done that. Gotcha. Oh, Black Knight Great Swords. At least we're getting some loot out of this guy. Shame, shame we can't use it. Yeah, 30 strength. Yeah, never in a million years. Ballista, round two. We can see it right over there. Okay, first the bone wheels. These guys are so much easier to deal with in this game. Mostly, mostly because they don't spin and stagger you continuously. the skeletons and now this guy back back away a little I wish I had that that agility There's one. You're the last one. Just stop it. Ah, oh, come on. Here we are once more. I don't think we need to pull one. He's right. Really? Over here. Oh, no, 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 no. Run away. I, I don't know, don't want to fight too. Okay, 
one. Where did the other one go? Is he still here? Beards? I'll take it though. Okay. Ballista off. Good thing I'm the only one who can turn it back on. Okay, and with that... Let's go back down. And defeat a whole bunch of crabs. Okay, let's be ready. There are a lot of them. Me or I'm not dealing that much damage. I feel like I should be doing more. Oh, you're still alive. All right, one shards. Here he comes. Two crabs down. Another shards. I don't need to kill all of them, but I'm going to. Three down, several more to go. Basically just doing this for some extra souls. How many more? Three? Let's go for this one. Okay, it's not this one, it's that one. That one doesn't... seems to be ignoring us. Now, heal quickly.
Uh oh. Uh oh. Dodged one and got caught by the other one. This is bad. I don't really want to fight crabs anymore. It's just too time consuming. So let's instead rush in, take the item, and get out. Or we'll just kill those three isolated crabs. Good thing we don't need to worry about the ballista anymore. is go there and grab that. Which is a chaos gem. Not sure if we need it. Probably not. And now we will go to the... Actually, I want to grab my souls. Wherever they are. There they are. That's probably one level right there. Okay, now we're running because I'm pretty sure the crab is following us. Okay, not anymore. Uh, I think it's about time we do the boss. So, let's get to it. We've wasted... Too much time already. So let's take out the boss. Which you can do just when you arrive at this area. Pretty early. Pretty early on. But I like saving it for last. There it is. The old Demon King. Gotta, we gotta be careful about a lot of fire. Like that. Oh. Okay, that uh, wasn't what I expected. That is... Uh, I, I was not getting away from that anyway. Summoning fireballs. Let's hide behind this mountain of corpses. Oh, you're going to summon fire. And here 
couple more fireballs. Here's the fire ring. Oh, it's the opposite way. Sometimes it uh, grows from him, sometimes it grows outwards. his hammer. I don't think I've noticed that before. Let's go to this bonfire since it's closer. So he doesn't really high damaging attack when he's down, huh? Usually when he's down like that, I can just finish him off quickly enough. Not this time. green I'm alive. doing that thing. Oh, it, ex it expands afterwards. Something with fireballs.
Damn it. There's an explosion. I see. There we go. Got him. Finally. Okay, and with that, Smoldering Lake is complete and also this episode. So thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed some more Dark Souls 3. And as usual, don't miss the next episode because I won't. I will see you all next time.